my name is Burak Aspinaji. Uh, I'm leading the Power Electronics and Electric Machinery Group. And I'm also the program manager for the Advanced Power Electronics and Electric Motors program. We are trying to uh, reduce the cost of power electronics so that the electric vehicles uh, would be more affordable to uh, consumers. And we're also looking at how we can get more miles uh, from the vehicles with the same amount of battery or reduce the size of the battery. We're trying to solve the problems uh, for 2020, 2022. So we expect, as the president said, more than a million electric vehicles by that time. And I see in the future us driving electric vehicles and we don't have to charge them anytime. We just drive on the highway with wireless charging and then we get our charge from one stop to the other and then just go forward. We don't have to worry about charging. You know, with wireless charging too, it will be much easier for us uh, at a lower cost to drive electric vehicles. We're trying to uh, reduce our dependence on foreign oil. And I think with electric vehicles, we will be able to achieve that. ORNL is the leading uh, national lab right now broad, for broad-based power electronics research. With this lead, we can actually help the nation reduce these, the cost of the power electronics electric machines in a vehicle. When you go to the National Transportation Research Center, you will find people working on the fuel engines to get them more efficient. You can find power electronics people, electric machines people, reducing the cost of the next generation power electronics and electric machines. And you can find anyone, any expert in any area you need on transportation. And looking at different technologies, we have distributed generation, we have solar work going on, we have microgrids, smart grid applications. So bringing the clean energy to the vehicles, that's what we did at Orna. So that makes us a great team and great lab to work on the, in this area.